Well, welcome back. Let us continue to, to worship God as we bow our heads in prayer. Let us pray. Oh God, our Father, we just want to praise you this day that you are the God who is faithful. We ask that you would help us to remember that you are the God who never sleeps, a God on whom we can depend in any and every situation. We thank you that you have been with us over these past months during these difficult times in the midst of a pandemic. Lord, when we feel lost and alone, teach us that you are there. In those times when we feel overwhelmed by it all and unsure of even our ability to get through, Lord, help us to remember that you are as close to us as breathing. And when we feel uncertain of the way ahead and maybe fearful of what the future may hold, teach us, Lord, that, that you are watching over us. Help us to understand that whatever we may face, you will guide us and guard us, protecting us from evil and unfolding us in your everlasting arms. And in that knowledge, may we meet every day with quiet trust and glad thanksgiving, for it's in Jesus' name that we, that we pray. And so together, let us, let us pray the prayer that Jesus has taught us to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who have trespassed against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, the power and the glory for ever and ever. Amen. This morning we're glad to have Serena Hamilton uh, sharing a, a kids talk with our young people. So, so sit back and enjoy it. But before just handling over to Serena, just a reminder to those in Kids Church not to forget to send in your rainbow drawings that I talked about a couple of weeks ago. And to send in those rainbow drawings either by post or you could leave them at the manse. And if, I'd be grateful if you could do that as soon as possible. And so now over to Serena. <laughs> 